and welcome back to Friday Night SmackDown. After another uh, couple dispute we just saw, it's the only way I can describe that. An unhappy re working relationship. Tipville USA is here to settle business. Vincenzo is pissed off after the roll-up situation with the losing the, the hardcore title. He said, Miss V, give me anybody. Just give me anyone. She said, Vinny, head on to the ring. Get your gear. And here we have it. He's with Ash Lou. He's with C. Lou, the former Renegade champion. You know, there's a lot of formers getting thrown around here recently. All right, listen there. <laughs> well, the, the landscape of this company is forever changing. And if you want to look up what a human steam really looks like in a dictionary, no other. Just, just look in the ring. Look in the ring for wherever you are. If you're in the skybox and you're in the front row, look in the ring. That's a human steam roller right there. Mm -hmm. Vincenzo. Man, this guy is something. He, he's been something ever since his return, hasn't he been? He has certainly so, and shown why, even just with a little bit of presence, what he can do. He has these sparks here and here. Well, he'll give us little four, three matches sometimes, disappear again. I'm looking for a full-time Vincenzo run and seeing what the Don can do here presently. He's a beautiful Renegade champion. I think he could be a beautiful, terrific world champion. And oh, who on here? Is getting sent out. Money, Keep his name alive. Under Who the hell is. Oh! The man! Man who has been making quite a bit of a in Ring of Honor as of lately. Miss B. Getting. Get, <laughs> welcome, Undisputed, to the AWF. But he's fighting Vincenzo of all people. Well, see, here's the thing. You know, Ring of Honor has produced some of the greatest talent in, uh, in professional wrestling history. Talk about Brian Danielson, right? Tyler Black. CM Punk. I mean, the list goes on and on. So, Undisputed coming from that crop is, is certainly a help. But, Ooh. Lord have mercy. Can I, can I, uh... Can I attest to Miss Biondi's sadism and the fact that she put this man against Vincenzo in his opening debut? Look at him! Yeah, this is going to be interesting. Undisputed doesn't look phased at all, though. Ashley and Silu there to watch. Tipville USA. Oh! And I, I can't attest to the fact there's not too many giants in the land of honor, you know? And, well, certainly seeing a giant right now with Vincenzo. This is a man, again, former Renegade champion. And quite frankly, he's just looking to get his footing back. And he's looking better than ever. But right now, undisputed nice leg drag gets him there. Well, let's hope this man wasn't expecting a handshake before the match. You know, the code of honor, handshake before and after the match. Let's see if let's see if undisputed can, can handshake Vincenzo if he's even conscious enough to do that. And punch to the face. No, he's not going to do it here. Undisputed Vincenzo getting whipped around. Look at these guys. A little dosico. Oh, and oh. He's muscled up to the ground. He's got that label lock wrenching across the eyes and nose. And Vincenzo caught in the middle of the ring. He is having some trouble. Ladies and gentlemen, fighting out of that. And the brute strength of the Harlemite. Oh, what a knockout punch. That was a blow to the back of the head. You know, those are dangerous. And a oh, Kamara lock. The mission of his own. Kamara lock. These men, this is, this is exactly why we need the sighting of, oh, Saiku oh, knee, hooks the leg not to be, Vinny out of the ring. We're talking about Ring of Honor, Kenta, Brian Danielson, both eat your own. Oh, and that did not end well for him now, did it? Cradles him up, suplex of hell. The Saiku knee, man, that was, that was classic right there. Let me show you some tape, but uh, they don't do this, they, they, they don't do this too much in Ring of Honor, let me tell you, deadlift, German suplex by Boom! the die. <laughs> I certainly say, this undisputed fella is making a, getting some fans right now, getting, making one out of me, but, oh boy, oh boy, he still has a, an uphill battle, hey man, hey man, you gotta get up, there's no heavenly way, Vincenzo, he's going up, that's a lot of weight, oh, well, and I don't, I don't necessarily read Greek mythology that much, but I can't remember the last time a Titan flew like that. And back into the ring, Vinny. He's back up. It is. He's at face. Oh, another boost cycle. He's from undisputed. And another like, rope break. You know, that's what happens. You got those long arms like Vincenzo does. And this is a hell to pay. An F one two five. You can hear that all the way from Harlem for crying out loud. And here. Going for the, not even hooking leg, just a cover. Oh, One, two. two. Whoa, and undisputed. You know, you got to believe the cover there. 
was the only reason why he was able to kick out of that F125. Vinny has had the honor of breaking in a few of rookies into the wrestling scene and whatnot, and let's just say, not a lot of them kick out of the F125. Breaking in a few rookies, talk about breaking the backs of a few rookies. And, and he's up, oh ending, my! Ending their careers. <laughs> oh, that's a rib crack, let me tell you. That's a swanton from a, you've gotta be kidding me. You've gotta be kidding me. Swanton from Vincenzo Butterfly. And you know we're in Sydney. They love rugby here. I, I think Vincenzo would be great at rugby. I mean, he's got the physicality and the explosiveness. You got the count of Charles Robinson going to six right now. And then the seven. Bash is undisputed against the apron. Hardest part of the ring. I feel like I'm obligated to tell you that. All the time. Back into the ring. And oh, those kicks trying to chop the big man down. But he got caught. Vinny knows a thing or two. He has dealt with the likes of the oh! best strikers and technicals of the AWF already. And they the believe all my suplex and this is where it begins. Is this the beginning of the end for undisputed? Those suplexes, those slams. And another Kamora lock! Yes. Oh, and look at that look at the technical expertise that time of undisputed. Chop. Going in for the... Oh! Looked like he was going for a pair of hugs. Sit him down. You know, those ROH guys are really good when it comes to, to grappling and things like that. A lot of them came from an amateur wrestling background. But this isn't amateur at all. He's sinking to the skies right now. Oh! Flying. Hooks the leg. Going in. Flying knee drop right to the rim. Woo! Kick out a one. How the hell? It's Vincenzo. It's the Don... I punched the he just fan. ate oh. that. He just ate that punch, but undisputed back and forth. Oh, oh, what my, a oh my goodness! Jesus. How the hell is he still standing? I think he might be out at his feet, but never mind. He's, He's back <laughs> out on his feet. The man seems to be standing on ten toes with Vincenzo. Yeah, he is peppering undisputed with these shots, and Vincenzo's trading back. Slaps back, stun back and forth, undisputed. Oh, call him that time. And certainly, oh my goodness! Oh, and now they're just having a hockey fight. This is SmackDown, where the best of it happens. They just knocked each other loopy. And both these men are out of it, undisputed. I'll, I'll say this kid is given more of a fight than anyone in this arena, including me, thought. And then Vincenzo here to follow up but oh come on believe. come on no you gotta believe that Don has been in many hockey fights that that in his life and undisputed met with a clothesline a huge clothesline it's like a a, a, a log or a tree bar a, a up top going high oh the splash sometimes all you need is a big splash one, one two, two three. three that's it Vinny Matt Vincenzo the Don gets it done. The Harlem Knight. Two Busaiku knees. That is how you do it. You know, a, a Busaiku knee has won some of the greatest things in professional wrestling. A WWE World Heavyweight Championship. A GHC Heavyweight Championship. But they didn't even, they didn't even get Vincenzo to bleed. That's just how you do it. That's the bottom line. And that's the Don. At least Tip Bill is back in the winning column for tonight. And they have another chance to advance the winning column with Mamba Ant versus Sip Tastic. Up next.